Hi everybody, Bionic Dance here. I told you I was going to do two videos today, and this is like the fourth or fifth take of this vid, but I'm trying like hell to get it right. You see, here's the thing. I've been talking to a lot of people about morality. Kind of came up on that whole problem of evil video that I just did, and it's come up other times as well, but the point is that, well, what is morality really? That's the question that's come up. What is morality? And, I mean, I've looked it up in various places, and you get various definitions, you know, like conformity to the rules of right conduct or behaving virtuously, things like that. But they never really get to what I feel is the heart of the matter, which is that as far as I'm concerned, morality is just another emotion. Now, first of all, I am an advocate of the notion that morality is entirely subjective, that objective morality is simply impossible. Because with the definitions of objective and subjective, well, if something is subjective, it's a point of view. It's, it's personal, it's an emotion, or it's a feeling, or it's even just something that you perceive on an individual basis. Whereas, if something is objective, it would be true even if there were no thinking, feeling, comprehending beings whatsoever, that it has an external existence. And usually that means tangible existence, although it, it doesn't have to. Uh, but, but it's pretty rare that it doesn't. Point is that morality is, well, like, like it says, the rules of right conduct, virtuous conduct, well, who decides what's right or wrong? I mean, we're, we're not talking about things like mathematic equations here. We're not talking about things with absolute definite answers that would be true regardless of perspective. No, we are talking about not right and wrong as in correct and incorrect, but right and wrong as in that's okay, that's not okay. How are those not opinions, and how are opinions not emotions? We feel something is moral or immoral. I mean, can you get people to give you reasons why something is moral or immoral that don't ultimately amount to personal feeling? I mean, even if we get to something like, well, killing is wrong, who says? I mean, I don't like it. You probably don't like it. But why don't we like it? Because personally, we'd feel that being killed would really suck. We don't want to be killed. And we can empathize with other people who might not want to get killed. But then, of course, we can look at people who are causing a lot of death who or causing a lot of suffering. Do I got to bring up Hitler over here? point is that we look at someone like that and we say, look, we consider killing to be wrong, but this person is doing so much worse than their death would be. It's just, you know, let's weigh the options here. We can allow tons and tons and tons of people to be killed, or we can allow one person to be killed to stop these tons of people being killed, which is worse, you know? And granted, that is a very sort of cutthroat calculation. That's a very just harsh numbers sort of thing. But again, why do we not want those people to be tortured or killed? Because we can empathize with them, because we can feel that what's happening to them is wrong, where we feel that making this person stop would stop all those wrongs, and we'd feel better about the state of the world. We would empathize, uh, or our empathy would not be going out to people who are, are hurting in ways we don't want them to, because it wouldn't be necessary for empathy to go out for them. So, again, virtuous conduct and, and morals, the, the, the behavior that's right or wrong, conformity to right conduct, it's an emotion. I mean, if anyone can actually refute this reasoning, I'd love to hear it. Usually when I get people telling me, nah, you're wrong, it's usually just, nah, you're wrong. Or it's usually just, I don't think so, and they reiterate what they don't think. They reiterate the, the things that I said were incorrect. And it's like, well, but you didn't give me any reasons why my position is incorrect on this one. So I'd love to hear it. If someone can actually give me a full-on explanation of, no, morality is not a feeling, not an emotion, I'd love to hear it, but if you're going to give me an explanation that basically says the same thing I said, but in different language, please don't bother. If we agree on everything but terminology, 
please. We agree, okay? If you want to tell me your terms are different, but they essentially mean the same thing, go ahead. I'd love to hear it. I'd love to find other ways to put what I'm saying. But really, what I want to hear is from people who disagree. People who say, no, morality is not an emotion. Morality is, and tell me why. That's what I'd love to hear from people. So, until next time, fellow space travelers, this is Bionic Dan saying, catch you later. Please take the time to rate this video. And hey, if you dig what I do, subscribe. And please visit my Sazzle store, where you'll find all kinds of Bionic Dance merchandise. Hey, this is a nice computer you got over here. Be a shame if you didn't rate and something bad happened to it.